Mobility Unbound. With the new technology of ExoGT and the research that supports this technology, it is certainly a right fit with advancing our, our neural rehabilitation program here in Central Ohio. Ohio Health Rehabilitation Hospital is part of a larger system, Ohio Health, uh, which is made up of 13 hospitals serving over 40 counties and 80 care sites. As the administrator for the hospital, I was not familiar with the ExoGT specifically. Our medical director, Dr. Lisa Lombard, was actually the one that recommended the piece of equipment you know, to our, our capital budget. The big hook for me is the fact that it was FDA approved for both spinal cord and stroke patients and that was a major difference from some of the other similar devices out there and given the fact that we have many more stroke patients and spinal cord patients I wanted to make sure we had a device for as many patients as possible. Partly our reason for choosing to purchase the ExoGT specifically uh, was to meet the need of being uh, a leader in neurorehabilitation in Central Ohio and part of Ohio Health's mission for neurosciences. Almost 60% of our patients that we treat have some sort of neurodeficit causing cognitive and uh, functional deficits. Our ExoGT is used every day. Part of having a program is ensuring that we have a program champion um, that can identify and work with other clinical specialists to identify these patients who would be appropriate for utilizing uh, the ExoGT. So there's not a day that it does not go without use and probably on a daily basis we have four to five patients that are utilizing the Exo for, for gait retraining. Reviewing uh, the literature and the research around the ExoGT really substantiated its cost. In working with our finance folks in, in deciding to purchase it was really because it, it presented a value proposition uh, to our neuro rehabilitation program. With the return on investment of reducing length of stay, um, increasing patient satisfaction, um, increasing our outcomes of discharge to the community, um, you know, were, were some of the uh, factors that really uh, led for us to purchase the equipment. In a value-based environment, it's about outcomes and about efficiency, um, helping to reduce the healthcare deficit by being fiscally minded in, in how we deliver care. Um, specific to inpatient rehab and with us being a neural rehabilitation uh, leader, um, this technology made sense for us. Um, it really allowed us to, with our main population of stroke patients and uh, spinal cord patients, to increase the time that we improve their ability to walk, essentially, um, was a win-win. Take the next step with us.